This is your June 2023 Maryland housing market update for Anne Arundel County. Hello, my friend, and thank you so much for watching. I'm James Bowerman, your Passing a Realtor, and we have officially entered the summer market uh, with inventory levels being very low. But the good news is we do see things tend to slow down. Now, this is good if you're a buyer, if you're a seller, pay attention. Last year, it was right around the beginning of July where days on market started increasing. We saw more price reductions happening. That's something to look at as we enter the summer here as more and more people you know, are going on vacations, kids are off of school, so less activity going on as people are busier and enjoying the nice weather. Let's talk about the buyers and the challenges that they face. Because of this low inventory, you're gonna find yourself in more situations where you're buying for the same property that other people want to be purchasing. Find the man, continues to be the story and it's going to affect you home buyers. Now with these higher interest rates, we are going to see the cost of borrowing go up, which is going to affect affordability and the purchasing power of home buyers out there looking right now. So far, we haven't seen a huge effect. The demand is still out there. I'm not sure at what point we'll hit a threshold where we say no more, but right now things are pretty steady. Average home sales selling in about 15 days. That's still pretty quick. Inventory remains at less than a month. Now homeowners that are thinking about selling, they need to be conscious of these challenges that buyers are facing. Understanding that this can be segmented to specific price ranges and specific neighborhoods. Now while we have seen an increase in the average sales price compared to last year, it's still important that sellers have realistic expectations when it comes to pricing their home in order to attract potential buyers. As we know, when a home sits on the market and it is priced too high, you're not going to get the show, but you're not going to get the offers and ultimately days on market is going to create kind of a stigma around the property that there must be something wrong with it and ultimately it's going to lead to a price reduction. We usually see more price reductions as we get later into the summer as homes are sitting longer so keep an eye out for that but just understand pricing your property even in a competitive market is extremely important. All right, that's going to do it for this month's market update. If you have any questions or comments or want to share your feedback on what's happening in your market, please don't hesitate to reach out, leave a comment. I would love to help you out in any way possible. Thank you again so much for watching. And until next time, I'll see you again soon.